Richard Gilliland, designing women actor and husband of Jean Smart, dead at 71. The actor also appeared in Criminal Minds and The Love Boat. Richard Gilliland, an actor known for roles in Designing Women and Airplane 2, the sequel, has died. The 71-year-old was married to Emmy-winning actress Jean Smart and suffered from a brief illness before passing away in Los Angeles, California, last week, according to a press release shared with Fox News. Gilliland and Smart, 69, were married for nearly 34 years. Gilliland met his future wife when they worked together on Designing Women, on which, he played J.D. Shackelford, a baseball talent scout and the boyfriend of Annie Potts Mary Jo Shively. He appeared in only 14 episodes of the show, according to IMDb, but his appearances were spread across the show's first five seasons. Smart famously played Charlene Frazier Stillfield for six of the show's seven seasons. They'd work together again several more times, including on the hit drama 24 in 2006 when Gilliland appeared in a single episode. Smart appeared in two seasons. The pair also appeared together on stage and in two television movies and were slated to work together again this summer in a film directed by the Girl on the Train filmmaker Tate Taylor. The pair share two children together, Connor, 31, and Bonnie, 11. Gilliland appeared in several high-profile television shows including Criminal Minds, Desperate Housewives, Dexter, Party of Five, St. Elsewhere, Operation Petticoat and The Love Boat. His movie credits include Airplane 2, The Sequel, Starkid, Homeroom and more. He also appeared in the touring Broadway production of Godspell as Jesus from 1972 to 1973. Born in Fort Worth, Texas, Gilliland attended the Goodman School of Drama in Chicago. His most recent credits include 2020's Case 347 and four episodes of Bravo's Imposters from 2017 to 2018, as well as his single appearance on Criminal Minds. In addition to Smart, Connor and Bonnie, Gilliland is survived by his sisters Ann Norberg and Wendy Nock and his brother John Wells.